Hello, everyone. My name is uh, Xie Min. I am the president of uh, Robotic Society of Singapore. I'm also editor-in-chief uh, with the International Journal of uh, Humanoid Robotics. Uh, first of all, I would like to thank the organizer of this forum for inviting me uh, to deliver this uh, recorded uh, speech. Today, I would like to share with you my thought about the value chain behind commercialization. My speech will follow this uh, outline. I will give you a short uh, introduction about the Robotic Society of Singapore. Then I will move on to invite you uh, to think about the, uh, this question of uh, what are our vision and the mission in command on Earth. And uh, lastly, I will share with you about the, my thought about the, our value chain in command on Earth. So let me start with uh, a short introduction about the Robotic Society of uh, Singapore. Robotic Society of Singapore is a professional uh, organization which is not for profit. Uh, this organization has been officially registered in Singapore in year 2010. The objective of the Robotic Society of Singapore is to uh, promote robot and the robotics among corporations and the individual who will believe that the robot will play a very important role in our uh, industry and uh, in our society in future. Uh, Robotic Society uh, of Singapore is also one of the founding members of uh, Asian Robotics Society Union. And the Robotic Society of Singapore is also one of the founding members of a World Robot Corporation Organization, which was uh, initiated by Institute of Electronics in China. Uh, it happens that uh, I am the founding president of the Robotic Society of uh, Singapore, and uh, this slide will highlight to you uh, about uh, my educational background and also my professional expertise uh, in robotics uh, and uh, in artificial intelligence. The technique strengths of the Robotic Society of Singapore include basic research, applied research, and product innovation. All of them are related to uh, robotics and also uh, artificial intelligence. Now, uh, let's move on to uh, the answer to this uh, interesting question, uh, which is about uh, uh, our uh, purpose okay, uh, on Earth. In other words, okay, we may want to know okay, what should be our vision and the mission in common on Earth. Because uh, by answering this question, uh, then eventually we may be able to converge to a consensus uh, about uh, our value chain uh, in common uh, on us. Uh, we may want to know, uh, okay, what should be the purpose for us to come uh, to us, right? Uh, maybe one universal answer is to say that uh, we come to us in order to fulfill our vision in common and uh, also our mission in common, right? Then we may want to know what should be our vision in common on Earth. Uh, here I just uh, list down uh, five uh, simple answers. I believe uh, that all of us uh, would like uh, to be happy on Earth would like to be healthy on us, to be wealthy on us, and also uh, all of us would like uh, to uh, live longer on us. And uh, lastly, all of us would like to be loved widely uh, on us. Then the next question will be, what should be our mission in common on us? But interestingly, I believe uh, all of us will agree uh, with uh, this uh, answer, which include uh, the task number one, 
which is to understand the war, and uh, our task number two, which is to improve the war. Then we may want to know how to uh, fulfill our mission in common on Earth, which include number one, to understand the war, number two, which is to uh, improve the war, right? If you look at the okay, uh, recommendation from uh, one of the older leaders uh, in China, then you will see okay, one recommendation is to uh, promote and uh, encourage research, innovation, and commercialization. All right? uh, the present leader in China also make uh, uh, this recommendation, right? Uh, he asked us to make sure that the, uh, our research achievement uh, must be at the cutting edge and also must be new, right? So then we may want to know, okay, how to make sure that the, our research achievement uh, will be at the cutting edge and also our research achievement will be always new, right? Then this uh, question uh, will uh, lead us to uh, think about uh, this question, all right? Uh, what should be our value chain in common on Earth, right? Uh, I believe that uh, our value chain in common on Earth must include uh, these uh, three type of uh, important activity, which are uh, discovery, invention and uh, manufacturing. Uh, in order to uh, fully understand uh, the interplay among uh, these uh, three type of uh, activity, it is uh, very important for us uh, to know what should be the uh, goal of uh, this uh, value chain, uh, what should be the driving force behind this uh, value chain, uh, what should be the outcome from uh, this value chain, right? And uh, here, I would like to share my version of answer uh, to this question. So I believe uh, behind this uh, value chain, uh, there is uh, one objective, uh, there are two driving force and uh, there are three uh, outcome. And uh, this uh, one objective uh, is to create better value, right? Which are exchangeable result in the market, right? So the key word here is uh, better, right? So we must uh, create better value, which are exchangeable result in the market, right? And uh, this answer also help us to understand uh, this question, uh, what is the value, right? So now you will see uh, the formula about the value. Value means uh, exchangeable result in the market, all right? And uh, I believe uh, behind this uh, value chain, uh, there are two driving force. The first driving force are social need, and uh, the second driving force are scientific problem. For example, discovery-related activity are basically driven by scientific problem. However, Activity which are related to invention and uh, manufacturing are primarily driven by social need, right? So uh, this, this slide uh, help us to understand that uh, two important uh, driving force behind this uh, value chain uh, in common on Earth, right? Then what should be the outcome uh, from this uh, value chain in common? And uh, I believe uh, there are three outcome uh, from this uh, value chain uh, in common, okay? The first outcome should be better theory. The second outcome should be better technology. And uh, lastly, the third outcome should be better product. And uh, most importantly, uh, better product should be the most important value uh, as the output from uh, this uh, value chain uh, in common on Earth, right? Then you may want to know why products are so important, right? Uh, basically, uh, without the product, we should not be able uh, to extend 
our physical capability without the product, we will not be able uh, to extend our mental capability. Therefore, uh, products are extremely important uh, for us to uh, not only to understand the world, but also to uh, effectively improve the world. For example, uh, the the discovery of uh, aerodynamic theory will uh, enable us to design a better version of uh, aircraft or airplane, etc. Right, and uh, the discovery of uh, aerodynamics theory and uh, all the invention, uh, okay, uh, derived from uh, aerodynamic uh, theory will enable us to create an entire industry uh, in the domain of uh, aerospace. Right. Uh, similarly, uh, AI-related theory will enable us to design and develop uh, a smart software, right? And uh, with uh, uh, the development of a smart software, then uh, you will see that uh, we should be able to create uh, uh, industry uh, such as a big data industry, right? Okay, so. This help you to understand uh, uh, products are extremely important uh, inside uh, this uh, value chain, uh, all right? Okay, uh, now I would like to conclude uh, my short speech, right? So basically the message I would like uh, to convert through this uh, speech is to pay attention uh, to this uh, value chain uh, incumbent uh, on us. And uh, in particular, we must promote uh, the interplay among uh, these uh, three type of uh, activity, which include discovery, invention, and uh, manufacturing. And uh, in particular, right, so our focus should be on nurturing uh, uh, value creation and uh, value chain. I believe uh, uh, this recommendation is in line with the theme of uh, today's uh, forum. Uh, thank you for your attention and uh, welcome you to visit our society's uh, website and uh, hopefully in future uh, we should be able to establish a uh, uh, collaboration or exchange uh, of uh, intellectual property uh, between China and uh, Singapore. Thank you.